Uh, didn't win the dice roll. So it's a terrible hand. Uh, we're going to have to mulligan that one away. So that's also a bad hand. We are going to get a scry. I think we've got to go. I think we just have to kind of keep this. Hope we draw another land to cast a silver girl adept. I really want to keep that on the top, but we need to be able to cast our silver girl as quickly as possible. So to the bottom it goes. Hey, Howrad. How's it going? Well, that's going to really hurt. So, um, Shops is not a great matchup. And uh, with one land and a Trinisphere out, it's going to hurt um, pretty badly. Depending on what kind of uh, Shops build this is, Nullrod might do okay for us. Um, if it's like a Ravager... Uh, you know, runs Triskillion, shuts off those cards. So Dark Depth, so that's interesting. So we kind of have to ho um, hope we string together a bunch of lands here. I have a feeling that uh, we're just not going to get around this Trinisphere in time. Oh yeah, so this is uh, this is super bad. Hmm. Yeah, I just don't know about this game. Um, you know, they got the Crucible Worlds down. If they find a Wasteland or they find a Strip Mine, um, that's just kind of concede on the spot. So they've got the Expedition map. Yeah, so we're just going to concede here. Um, we're not going to be able to fight through this Tangle Wire. They've got an Expedition map to go find a Wasteland or a Strip Mine and start um, just keeping us off land. And with that Trinisphere, um, all it takes is getting one of those lands into play and we'd be done. So I think we're going to bring in Ghost Quarters. I kind of like Chain of Vapor. I might actually take the Null Rods out. It's obviously an artifact heavy deck, so I mean it might be the wrong call. Um, but I want to bring in some Stifles. We saw Dark Depths, if they try to go for like the Dark Depths combo. Um, and it looked like maybe they were a build that just ran a lot of static sort of hate effect um, artifacts, in which case those Null Rods aren't going to be as useful. I kind of want to leave in some missteps, but I don't think they're going to be as useful in the Shops deck. Um, and in fact, I think I might just board them all, all out. We saw an expedition map. They might run like Voltaic Key. I might leave two in. It's nice to keep enough blue for our Force of Wills as well. Alright, so let's see how that goes. Hey, welcome to the stream if you just joined. Playing some Merfolk in the vintage practice room, or the tournament practice room. So we don't really, we don't have any wastelands, uh, ghost quarters are our strip mine. I'm tempted to kind of mulligan into one, 
but I think uh, we'll be able to get a Silvergill Adept out, draw a card. Got these true names. Those could be good in the matchup. I don't know that six is going to look better than this, so we're just going to go ahead and keep. Uh, we'll re reveal the Curse Catcher. Because it might be the only thing we can cast next turn. Alright, so we we'll kind of want to find that Stifle now. I'm going to run out this uh, Phantasmal Image, copy the Silver Girl Adept, try to draw a card. So uh, that's really good. We're going to save this Curse Catcher for that Force of Will. So I'm going to the Tangle Wire Resolve. Um, we have uh, enough of a board. I'm going to be able to run out, hopefully, maybe this Curse Catcher. And then I'll have enough permanence to kind of get around it. And it's going to disappear uh, eventually, and it hurts them as well. So I'd rather save that Force of Will for something that um, is going to kind of stick around and really be a thorn in our side. Unfortunately, it means that if I have to use this Force of Will, I'm going to use a True Name Nemesis, but I think that the Tangle Wire is going to hurt them um, significantly, and I'm, I'm building this board up where we're going to be able to start swinging in. And they've got this Ancient Tomb that's also dealing them damage. So that kind of stinks. Probably won't say. Probably won't keep the curse. Well, hmm. So we'll tap. We'll have to tap the creatures. I mean, we could just not pay for the creatures, get a true name into play. So I think we'll leave um, one creature untapped. Make sure I do this right. So we've got to do three. Well, we might as well tap the um, creature because hmm. If I pay one to keep it, I'm still gonna have to tap. I'm not gonna be able to run out of true name nemesis. Nemesis. So, yep, I'm gonna tap that. I'm gonna say no. No. We might as well pay to keep one. Run on island. True name nemesis. And pass. So we've got plenty of mana once that tangle wire disappears to um, start paying to save these creatures. So 
is actually kind of not bad that we're drawing this land right now. So as the board stands right now, I'm going to be able to save both these creatures next turn. Tap two on the tank wire, tap two to save the creatures. So I am... So I'm going to force this tangle wire. Um, we're just giving them too much time if we let it resolve and we're tapping down um, all of our permits because that's going to be... Four, five, six. We're going to be tapping down everything. So I think we have to force this. It's kind of a shame they got the Urborg. Um, It lets them use their ancient tomb without having to pay life. And then also if they get, um, if they draw into like a vampire hex mage or uh, um, what do you want to call it? The dark depths and then uh, they can cast a vampire hex mage if they're running it. So chain of vapor is interesting. So we've got plenty of land to play around this Tangle Wire. Chain of Vapor's uh, gonna get rid of a... Um, whatever the token is for the Dark Depths. I'm blanking at the moment. Yeah, Merit Lage, that's right. Alright, so we'll just tap down an island. Definitely pay to keep the true name in the Silver Gill. So we've got enough to cast the Master, which is great. Oh man, I'm dumb. I needed to leave that chain of vapor up. So that was a punt. So now we just die. Oh, that's a real shame. Oh well. So yeah, we're just going to go ahead and concede this one. So it's kind of a bummer. We drew the answer that we needed. Um, I just wasn't thinking and ran out that Lord. 